Hi, uh, today I'm going to show you how we can search through a zip file uh, even without extracting uh, it into a normal file format. So in this example what I have is uh, a news shop, news.zip folder. If you open it you see that there are uh, three, three text files. Uh, those are nothing but uh, straightforward text files. So let's see how we can uh, open the zip files even without uh, extracting any information from it. So first thing we need is uh, a package called zip file. Oops, zip file. Uh, if you have not installed you need to run this command to install zip file uh, strangely we have to queue 36 uh, for this package to be installed this file now we can use this package so what I would try to do is I will uh, search for a string for now we will take uh, very fine. Uh, some string which we have to say. Now we need to use this zip file module zip file dot zip file. You give the zip file name which was news dot zip. So this you can see here it has this file this is what i am now uh, copying it to a zip variable now let's iterate through this zip dot name list the name list gives all the files within the zip folder so we will first try to print the file name let's see what it gives so run run this and it gives that it has a zip fold news folder and it has three different files okay so now that we know that uh, we get the file names let us go ahead and uh, search for the content so what we have to do is We will first open the file for since this is a zipped file, we need to use the zip dot open file name. And once the file name is opened, we can search through the file menu using the enumerate command file and we'll start with the one now it's a simple search which we have already done in the last video uh, let's make this case sensitive search so i am putting converting the text into lower so that uh, it is a case insensitive search so let me print uh, the matching line now here Let's see, does this see if it works? So, yes, it has found this, but we don't, uh, it has found a match in one of the files, but we don't know in which file it was. So, let us also print the file name CQ space, and we can also print the line number. We will separate it out for it to be in line. Oops, okay. Uh, the line number is an integer, so we need.
it we cannot it to a string so that was the error and uh, yes so now it says in itr.txt i found uh, this value okay let's see uh, something called telegram the second file contains mostly of telegram so here if you see so all of this are from the telegram folder the third one was about uh, was some news about russia so just searching through that you to try to find something common so this word must da must be there in all the files so let's see yes here we go you have it in telegram text you have it in russia news dot text you have it in itr dot text yes so this simple piece of code is searching through a zip file now you can use this to search for multiple different things so i hope you got uh, some head start into this yeah that's it then thank you bye